Is everything with 25% yeah. off? Everything. We don't go to many estate sales, but when we do, it seems like we have great luck. And today we found some incredible 80s figures that you're gonna wanna see if you stick around for this video. Check it out, I couldn't believe it. It was G.I. Joe heaven. Floor or upstairs, main floor, and basement. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you. And this is our last day here, so. Okay. Oh, okay, you will get them. So the first floor was littered with stuff that we don't typically like, you know, just like plates and glassware. So we went upstairs hoping that maybe they had some good like vintage men's clothing. And we were actually in luck because we did find one room that had a few men's clothing items. Not a lot though for us to look through. However, we did find one single stitch Garth Brooks concert tour shirt and we were happy to find that. And it's, it was $5, but we are getting a discount at the end of the video that you're going to see. The basement, however, that is where all the best scores were. That is where we found all of those 80s toys. Check out the footage. It was incredible. Everything with 25% yeah. off? Yeah, everything. Well, I was looking at the Garth Brooks shirt. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm like, it's excellent condition. How, how, how much is for, like, men's clothing? Because it does just have the price for women's clothing upstairs. It's the same. Is it the same? So it's like five a shirt. Yeah, yeah. That's like women's, like, it could be anything. Yeah, it's it could neutral, be. And there's only oh, okay. Women. So, yeah. Like, if we bundle up, like, things, do they give a bigger discount off? Um, they might, but I'm not promising. Yeah, Later yeah. in the day, at, in the afternoon, things might be priced differently as well. Too. Right. Uh, we yeah. still have a client that we deal with, so the client kind of sets it. So the yeah. client says this morning, it's going to be 20 bucks enough, but later in the afternoon, mm -hmm. Um, These are pretty nice. Some of the accessories. Are yeah. Yeah. Like, this is wild. Yeah, this is yeah. the same. This, this, might this be collection is whole, like... Yeah. Okay. I don't like, this is not a lot of personal. Like, we deal with... Like, this is so cool. The Shira? So, I keep trying to move on to the episode. This is a part. Yeah, you can try. See, you see vintage toys. No, and these <laughs> amount of vintage toys, like it's twenty five percent off. So, like even if you want to keep something to yourself, like to your collection, it's worth it. I'm gonna move something like this strand. I can go somewhere because it's so hard to find and like well. Well, like placed. Is there a specific spot where I'm going to find a calculator, or yeah. do I yeah. have to? Yeah, no. So, do you have a phone? Do this. Okay. Okay, right now we're in the accessories with them, just wild. There you go. So, I think, would you? He's got his dog with him too. Yes. Oh, shit. Ah. That's all. No, that's okay. So I just want to Okay. Like any of these. Right. And then you just start. And it's right there. Oh, I did. I did. I did. Is that a cobra? 
the bad guys are probably mm -hmm. the better ones to grab. Oh, this one has all the missiles, but I guess it's for that one. Really? I think it is for this ship here, right? Ooh, that's tempting. Because this was here. Mm -hmm. So I don't know if it's for this or for that. But this ship, wow, well, it's just missing one wing. So you're paying this. Okay, thank you. Yeah, it's missing one wing there. What is that box there? I don't know if this is. I would get these. This is the prices is... on these. Or... These were odds and ends that didn't even belong. Some of them is He Man. Oh, okay. He -Man. Uh, this is He Man. This is go with this. This is Star Wars. It was odds and ends. I could put the stuff that's just. Um, Mommy, can you say anything? Yeah. G.I. Okay, thank you. Do you know if this this one that this bag that is here is for the the ship here or if it's for the tank? <laughs> This one. This goes with the ship. The ship. Okay. Trust me, I've done all my research on all of this. If you want to talk about it, yeah. so everything was um, like the prices, how it came up with two. Um, we looked at what sold on eBay, and that's what I had to look because I wanted to make sure everybody came with all the right pieces. And then I looked at how many times they sold, like five times, took the average, and then I went down from there. So it's actually about twenty five percent off the amount that they sold for on eBay consistently. And eBay. Um, it's crazy. People will just buy heads. Yeah, like we, <laughs> we we do, and yeah, we do so toy like the shows. The prices are really fair. Yeah. And then it's 25% off of that now. You already yeah. had a 25% off, but it's 25% yeah. off of that. We do toy shows as well. So for us to grab people for our, to our table when we get like yeah. this type of vintage toys, it's pretty like good. So that's why we are trying yeah. to... No, the prices are totally fair. When we saw, we were like, oh my God, this is our dream. We should oh. find somewhere. <laughs> we had the first guy in line yesterday. Uh, so we opened at 10 and yesterday he was in line at 7.30 in the morning um, to buy G.I. Joe. Because yeah. he had a toy store too, but his toy store flooded in January. So, oh. Um, yeah, it's pretty nice. And we collect some of them. So. Same with him. He's like, it's kind of like being a drug addict when you're still working on drugs. Yeah. Like, it's really hard to be like, do I need that? Yeah. <laughs> I get to get some of the Star Wars, though. Yeah, I know. Okay, I was like, yeah. did you see them? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. I could not for the life of me figure out how to attach it, but... And not, and not like having a, be afraid of breaking it. Yeah, like, breaking. So it's funny. There's that one guy in there. Um, he's got two broken thumbs. I can't remember his name. No. And people were excited about him, but they're saying, they're saying he almost always has broken thumbs. Always. Uh, and I'm like, okay, good to know. I'll watch for him to not have yeah, broken thumbs. Yeah, have one day, who knows. It's because he had broken thumbs from the get-go. I guess he didn't hold his yeah. weapon properly. Yeah, probably. How much it will be if we have the money? Yeah, if you have the money, yeah. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Okay, there's this one too if you want. It's 12, but it's 25%. Sure, thank you. You want to grab it? Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Do you guys normally have a party? Let me know. No. We end up all over the city. The last house I had GI Joe too. We get because of the clientele we deal with. A lot of like vintage toys. That's what we look the most. So sign up for um, our email. So you okay. just name and all we email out is the same. So you'll see an inventory and a bunch of photos. And okay. Look through the photos and go, oh great. So the first day is a little crazy with lineup, but after the first hour and a half, if we don't sell the 
the item and you call and be like, oh, do you have this? And if you have a picture in the picture, and let us know. You can pay a little bit and we'll hold it for one hour. Oh, great. So the first people are, like some of our sales, I've had 120 people in line before the doors open. So based on what we get. So that's why it's great to be on the list to see because I guarantee you a recent choice. Okay. Perfect. Thank you so much. I need a time Every picture I have, they're all my cherry. Oh, look at you. No, no, I don't want to. They're all my You just learned never to be an exception. Your socks are so bad. Yeah, do you guys need more men's clothing? No, so. that was it. That was it. Okay. Literally, that's the only thing up there that okay. was men's. So t-shirts or what? Five, I think. Oh, okay. So Short we'll sleeve. go. We'll, we'll just add this up. What's CLS? It said 12. Oops. CLS. She just did this now. Parts lot CLS. I don't know. I'm just going to write it down the last year. <laughs> yeah. It's $12. Okay, so 5, 17. Ooh, look at this. Hold on, Dana. 35. 5, 17, right? 35? No, just hold on, okay. Dana. Sorry. That's okay. <laughs> it's 18. <laughs> no, I know. So 12 and 5. 12 and 5. I just do this so that you guys can have a copy of it. Mm -hmm. 18, 25. 18. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, a little motorcycle. I don't know if it goes with the dude, but I thought it was kind of cool. 25. 20. 35. Calculator time? Yeah. <laughs> It's all in my head right now. I think it is exactly what forty five dollars. <laughs> You're gonna impress me there. Dang it! I'll give you a good time. Okay. Twenty five plus yeah, we'd come later, but um, you know, she's got to go to work today. Yeah. And I heard she's like, oh, if you come later in the day, if they're still there, you get more of a discount potentially. And I'm like, oh, damn it. <laughs> I'll give you a good deal. So this is coming to $170? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's half of that 85. $85. Thank you. Sure. Thank you. Sucks for those who have to work, right? I know. All right, so... Um, she gave us 50% off on all this stuff. It was supposed to be only 25% off, so we only ended up spending $85, including the vintage Garth Dick shirt. I don't know, I'm tempted to kind of go back and just grab a few more things, because I was gonna pay on card and we use cash. I think I'm gonna go grab a few more things, because I really wanted that big ship with the missiles for 60. That one was really tempting. Yeah. So, I don't know, I'm gonna put this in the car and I'm, like, I'm gonna pick it up. That and I actually did end up going back to that estate sale to pick up even more G.I. Joe vehicles and figures that you're going to see at the end of the video, which is right now. Holy cow, this was the first estate sale that I've uh, ever been to in Calgary, and I'm really happy that we actually ended up going. At first, I wasn't very optimistic because when we first walked in there, there was a ton of like just... Uh, silverware like dining stuff plates stuff that I don't really I mean there's probably some value there for people who actually are interested in getting those things but when you're selling on eBay things that are that fragile and, and you know tend to break it's not really something I really want to find or source at an estate sale but nonetheless that's kind of what was on the first floor we went straight up to the second floor found the, the Garth book shirt and that is like single stitch vintage very cool if it was metallic or like something that's a little more universal uh, than Garth Brooks. Still happy with that. Spent like, well, it was $5, but then we actually ended up getting 50% off of everything. So we spent like $2.50 for the shirt. Really good. And check this out though. This is the main reason why I love this. This estate sale It's just wild. So we got so many things for 50% off. 
look at all of these accessories here. I'm not sure like what's in here, but for 18, and we also got this for nine with 50% off, uh, the amount of accessories, we could probably maybe get $50 for this because some GI Joe accessories, depending on uh, what vehicle or like what ship they go for or even character, they can be worth like tons and tons of money. You also got all of this for even like $12. So this was $6. This is more GI Joe parts. I might just do a massive lot with all of these together on eBay, list it for like a hundred to $150 and it'll probably sell within a few days. That's how crazy GI Joe accessory stuff is. Uh, you know, depending on what we actually have here, I'll probably have like a make your, make an offer on there as well. And that will help it sell even faster. Really excited about that. We also have some vehicles here, a nice uh, 1984 Mark II Jeep. So we got this for 50% off. So we didn't actually pay 35. We paid half the price for that. Nice, it actually is complete as well. Uh, a nice motorcycle. I don't think this is actually complete. I think it's missing a part. This is probably one of the worst buys we had. We still only paid $6 for this, not bad. Uh, this missile, I'm not sure if it goes, because I was checking out these earlier. This might have to go back in this bag, because I don't think it goes to anything here. Uh, we also have a complete uh, ski mobile, not bad. It also has the completed missiles here for the front. I couldn't find a way to get them inside though, but uh, it looks like these are complete. Oh, the that missile. Maybe is, yeah. Ah, there we go. Ah, the missile goes here. My, my wife actually caught that, so perfect. Good eye. Yeah, so it is 100% complete. These can sell for like up to like $50 and we got it for like nine. So really happy about that. We also got five GI Joes here. I looked for anything Cobra because I know Cobra ones usually sell for a little bit more. Uh, very happy with these. Uh, these two right here are probably the best finds. Um, you know, they're both Cobra. They got the nice black outfits here. Uh, this one was really cool because it comes with this gun and it's uh, his backpack. So. I, that's amazing to see this in this condition and this complete is unbelievable all in all super happy with everything that we got today and i have to say if there's more estate sales like this in the future we did get their card i am definitely going to try to find them because i am like thrilled with what we picked up anyways hope you enjoyed today's video if you did leave a like down below subscribe if you are new to the channel with that being said may your carts always be full